marine ecosystems are threatened both uh, locally and globally. At the local level, of course, the coastal zone hosts a lot of human activities, important human activities like urbanization, like agriculture, um, industry, of course, and other uses, which cause uh, localized forms of degradation like pollution, let's say. But on the other hand, we have uh, large-scale phenomena like uh, global warming or uh, ocean acidification, which, of course, uh, join together with the local uh, uh, pressures and uh, cause sometimes uncontrolled effects. Here in Crete, we are located in the Eastern Mediterranean. The Eastern Mediterranean is the, right now is the warmest uh, place of the Mediterranean basin. Uh, this, alongside with uh, adjacent uh, with uh, Suez Canal, uh, makes this place uh, very susceptible to change right now. So what we see here is an early warning of things that will probably spread towards the west in the Mediterranean in the forthcoming years. And of course, these things also happen at the global level. I mean, uh, global warming is a global threat, of course, and uh, species uh, coming from other parts of the world is a universal trend right now uh, because of this ongoing change. We are of course, of course concerned because uh, we, we feel it is our duty to preserve this biodiversity for future generations. Uh, and we feel that uh, uh, right now it's uh, in the verge of becoming uh, degraded. Uh, nature has its ways and uh, this richness will be replaced by another richness. Uh, problem is mainly to us because we, are, uh, built, we have built our lives with this biodiversity. So the loss of this biodiversity would main, mainly affect uh, humans as a species. Um, the services it, pro it provides to us, the food, uh, the, the environment, uh, all the, the stuff that makes our life um, mm, nice to live. <laughs>